One of your most important decisions, believe it or not, is going to be the handle. Why? It's what you hold on to. But one of the things you should really look at is, is this handle going to be good for me now and in the future? And there's different things to look at. These two are two handles that are listed in some of the diagnostic sets. The one on your left is going to be the lithium ion handle, or the black one. It's very lightweight, very durable, but in some of the diagnostic sets, it'll come with a well adapter that you can use later in your practice. The silver handle here uh, works off of a nickel cadmium battery, but can also be used for regular C cell batteries. Let's talk about this one first. When you look at this handle here, you've got your rheostat located right at the top. I would just unscrew, plug it into the wall, charge it overnight. I want to make sure I put that ophthalmoscope or retinoscope on this handle and leave it on all night or use it. You want to make sure you drain out the battery with this certain handle. The nice advantage to this one, if for some reason that third year I decide to go to Honduras on my mission trip and we've got no power, I might need C-cell batteries. What I can then do is unscrew the top, put my C-cell batteries in, and then use this adapter that comes with the diagnostic set. Once I put the C-cells in, I can now put these on. This will go right back into your case, and I'll put the top back on, and you're ready for your mission trip. But you gotta keep in mind, how often are you gonna be on a mission trip? Now let's talk about the lithium ion. This happens to be the market leader. It's lithium ion technology. I'm sure you're familiar with the uh, lithium ion technology and all the phones and everything else that's coming out. What's really, really nice about this one is when I'm using it and I'm in the back of the eye and I'm looking, there's a little bitty line here. This will turn a bright orange. This bright orange is gonna be our low battery indicator. Let's just know we got five or 10 minutes of on time depending on how high we have the rheostat turned up. What's also nice about this unit is it comes with what's called a well adapter. This is going to fit in the lane that you'll be working in. And then what will happen is it will allow you to charge this handle in the future. So although you're investing in this now, this will work for you later on. Not to say that the silver one or the NICAD battery couldn't, but you'd have to go grab it, unplug it out of the wall, screw it on, then put your ophthalmoscope on, and you're not going to do that. Trust me. Another key component to the lithium ion handle, we talked about the well adapter for later on, but what about when you're in school? You don't want to worry about too many things. If you look on the back here, you'll see a desk charger. There's sets that come with the desk charger. You've got lights that indicate it's charging. The other thing that's nice, it comes with an AC adapter. This also conveniently fits into your set. So when you're in lab and you're using the ophthalmoscope or retinoscope and your battery goes out, you can use one of these. Plug it into the wall in the lab and use the other handle that's located inside your diagnostic set. Hi, I'm Larry Jurisic with Pioneer International and I'm here today to talk to you about Hina Diagnostic Set Handles. There are two varieties of the Hina Diagnostic Set Handle that you'll see. And one is the Lithium Ion Beta NT and the Beta Slim, which is Nickel Metal Hydride. The runtime on the lithium ion beta NT is two hours. The beta slim runs for one hour. They both charge very conveniently in the Heine desk charger, actually, which is included with the purchase of all Heine diagnostic sets. And it's really the best way to do it. You can come home and you can charge up your cell phone and your handles really at the same time. Very convenient, easy to use just by slipping in the proper adapter. They both give you an option of using batteries as well. Should you be in class and you run out of power, you always will have a second handle. Keep that in mind. That's why you need two handles for your uh, diagnostic set purchase. You need two handles. So when one handle does go dead on you, you'll always have a second one. But should you require, both kind of handles will take batteries very, very easily. With the Beta Slim, all you do is remove the end cap, Take the battery out, put in a couple of AA cells, no sleeve or anything like that that you have to look for or adapter to uh, make the AA's work. Put the AA's in there, replace the end cap, and you're ready to go uh, on AA power. On the Beta NT, the end cap on the Beta NT 
put in a couple of C cells, put in a couple of C cells and replace it with the furnished battery adapter end cap, has that little spring there on it. That will make the C cells work in your Heine Beta NT handle. Again, no reason to look for any sort of adapter sleeve on the Beta NT. You just insert the C cells and the proper end cap with the spring and you're ready to go on C cell power. There's one more feature I may show you on this Beta NT, and it is an optional feature. I actually have a couple options here to show you, but this particular one is a, uh, a wall adapter uh, plug adapter for the bottom of this Beta NT handle, and how this works is like so. Uh, again, if you have, which you are going to have two handles uh, for class, so one handle goes dead, you have the option of using this Beta NT adapter to charge right in the wall in class or clinic. Very nice useful piece, something to consider when you're looking at your diagnostic set. Like I say, this is an optional piece, but I think it might be well worth having uh, just for emergencies. One other um, special piece that Heine manufactures is the little twist lock adapter. Uh, what this uh, allows you to do is to use a panoptic head with your Heine uh, handle. Say you like the panoptic head, but you're not uh, particularly uh, thrilled with a uh, Welch Allen uh, diagnostic set. Uh, by buying this twist lock adapter, you can adapt that panoptic head to either of the Heine handles, the Beta NT or the Beta Slim, like I showed you. Uh, something to consider, like I say, if you're not uh, really crazy about a wall challenge diagnostic set, but you like the panoptic, you can buy this little adapter to use that panoptic on your Heine handles. Thanks so much for spending a little time with us today. Uh, it's Larry Jurisic with Pioneer on these Heine handles.